I'm with a Jeremy. I'm with Apocalyptica today. <laughs> you see, make sure everything. Goes. Oh, okay. Now I got to see you guys play with Nikki Six in Kansas City about maybe two or three weeks ago. How was that? Being on tour with them. That was a great tour. It was our kind of launch to our Shadowmaker album tour, and a great chance to get to play with a great band. Great chance to meet new fans who haven't seen us before, and good fun with all the three bands, Six AM, the bands from Japan, and us. Now, how would you uh, like Kansas City in the venue you were at? Because it's kind of a historical place. It's beautiful. It's amazing. Hysterical? Hysterical. Oh, historical. Historical. The, the, the oh historical. yeah, yeah. <laughs> What's that? Sorry, Sorry that's so wrong. Histor uh, significant, very old. Yeah, but yeah, and agreement the place. What was the name uh, of? No, the Midland. Midland. Yeah, Midland. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's yeah. super like a, beautiful, yeah, beautiful layer. What kind of ballroom? Not the, uh, it's like yeah. a uh, yeah. cool theater yeah. with the, all the balconies and everything. So, okay. but that was great. Now, uh, you guys released a few music videos, and I heard you have a new one you're working on right now. Yeah. Care to tell a little bit about that? Really? You heard wrong. Oh. <laughs> oh, are we, we? We released uh, Cold Blood, which is out, out now, and uh, that's been out for maybe a few months, and we are very proud of it. It's the first real single for, from this album. Uh, but we have not yet started to make another video from this album, so it will take some time, and we are... Well, maybe you heard about the document. Documentary. That's that's a different thing. And documentary is something we don't quite know when it's going to be out. It should be ready fairly soon. And that's kind of a document to tell the story of Apocalyptica from the very early stages to where we are now in the whole trip and everything it holds in between. And we are quite excited. And maybe it'll get played on the Sixth Sense, or he'll be sponsoring it. He, uh, this Nikki will be involved through our label for sure. So. Now, uh, this is your first time playing in Rock, Oklahoma. What are you expecting to, a little bit about 455? Of course, an amazing lineup. It should be packed of people. Hopefully, the weather will be cool, but we, we are going to deliver our best for the short set of time. But, uh, of course, excited to see the uh, great other bands as well. For example, I've never seen Godsmack live, and today we should watch up. Now, do you guys are going to start playing any games like TuneSpeak for fans to win a chance to get some of your stuff or tickets? Come again? Uh, it's called TuneSpeak. A lot of your famous bands use them, and you can get uh, meet the bands, uh, tickets to the show, like one of a kind items. But they have to listen to your songs, watch your videos, and it racks up. Uh, we have have this. Yeah, we had it though. Yeah. Actually, on six AM tour. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, and yeah we, we did. Had it. And we are pretty active. Basically, nearly every day in every city, we have some kind of meet and greet. And I don't know, yeah. know how they ent enter there. Is it a competition or something like this? But they, uh, at least there is a lot of activity. We like to interact with our fans. It's important Definitely. to see the people who, who, for whom we basically make this. Of course, we make the music for ourselves, but also to, we kind of need the listeners. Are you planning on doing like a, four to uh, a full tour later on in the winter too? We are doing all the time a full tour. So with the 6 a.m. we toured for one month. Mm -hmm. Now we are doing a headlining tour for one month, and this is U.S. only. So now we go to Europe to do festivals for two months. Two months. Then we do European tour for six weeks. Then we do U.S. Uh, uh, Russia for maybe two three two three weeks. Then we do U.K. for two weeks. <laughs> we go. So I consider it to be full-ish <laughs> tour. Yeah. Do you have a favorite venue or place you like to visit? Home? <laughs> <laughs> that we like to visit. Yeah. yeah, I like to visit home every now and then. You cannot define a, a no. favorite venue, really. But the USA must be one of the favorite places to tour. Yeah, it, touring was so compact nice. every every day. Very nice in here, and people are friendly, and audiences are amazing. And once again, it has been very like uh, we have been delighted to notice that people still remember <laughs> us. They still love us, and we, now we played like. Uh, one week of headlining shows already on this leg of the tour and uh, I have been just like purely enjoying my life in here. Is there anything you want to say to your fans or your websites? Hey, this is how you can find us or iTunes, music, anything? Please follow us. We are all over in social media. Apocalyptica Official uh, or Apocalyptica you find from Instagram, Facebook, YouTube. Uh, we are all over and uh, we really like to connect with our fans. We put lots of funny material over there and our meet and greets, Beth was talking about, we always uh, shoot footage over there too. We uh, do some special acoustic performances over there. So it's great and uh, like I said, it's amazing to get to, to tour in the States and to be part of these great festivals. We did uh, Rock on the Range a few weeks back and now being here, so it's 
great. Uh, great tour. Thank you very much. Thank, thank you. you. Can I thank ask you. one question? Uh, absolutely. Oh. Okay. The shirt. Why the shirt? It was, fr it was free. Oh.